Austin, a 62-year-old man, made history by becoming the world's first to successfully receive a pig kidney. He underwent the transplant last month and was discharged from the hospital yesterday. Jennifer Panayat has more on this remarkable story. Photos that mark the beginning of a new life for Rick Slayman. They were taken moments before he was released from Mass General. Nearly three weeks ago, the Weymouth man made history alongside his team of Mass General doctors and nurses. We're going to learn a lot with Mr. Slayman. He was brave to go through a procedure where there were so many unknowns. For years, Mr. Slayman's life depended on dialysis. That's until the 62-year-old agreed to become the first person in the world to receive a kidney from a pig, genetically edited for the human body. But what he taught us is that it is possible. Dr. Leo Riella, who Slayman helped perform the four-hour-long uh, surgery, says Mr. Patients. Slayman is doing well despite his body briefly rejecting the pig's kidney. Mr. Slayman is not speaking publicly yet, but in a statement thanked his doctors, writing, This moment, leaving the hospital today with one of the cleanest bills of health I've had in a long time, is one I wished would come for many years. Now it's a reality and one of the happiest moments of my life. The groundbreaking transplant offering hope to the nearly 90,000 kidney patients on diet. Analysis. Mr. Slayman's doctors are now working closely with the FDA to create a path toward clinical trials. And hopefully then, you know, bring it to clinical practice, bring to all patients that are on the waiting list that don't have a kidney and may have to wait too long. Now, the hospital said scientists also deactivated a cell nuclei that contains the viruses in the pig donor to eliminate any risk of infection in humans.